I'm sorry if you heard you, it's a fan. I'm sorry if, you know, what I'm saying is annoying to you. I'm just giving you my opinion and my experience. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. How are you doing? What's been happening? Guys, I had just for you. Yesterday, I broke the internet, literally. I put a post up and before 30 minutes after I put the post up, like less than 30 minutes, I got like over 50 comments. People were, it was just crazy. The post is about me and CC, but I'm like, you know what? I have to come and tell my YouTube family because I feel like on YouTube, I'm more expressive. I can tell you exactly how I feel. I know we can rub minds. But before I start gisting you, if you're not subscribed to this channel, I beg now, please now. It's important to me and I give sweet gist. So please click the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. So I have VCA now. I met a lot of people. I met Chloe, I met um, Rico, Anika. Uh, oh five father and everybody was cool and easy and sweet in fact rico was somebody who i was very amazed at because when i went to meet him to take a picture with him yeah the light went off literally like you know rico yeah kept on turning and turning and so as in we're turning until we got the brightest angle the brightest picture i was like oh my god like i was very amazed it's on my instagram page go and check it out and then i met cc guys okay let me give you because the main gist of this whole video is sissy's me meeting sissy so at the after party i saw her walking i was like oh my god i was very excited because i mean i watched bb ninja all through like time in the house i felt like you know where yeah, i know this girl i should just take a picture with her or make a video with her or something you get so i went like an hour when she stepped in i went to meet her i'm like oh hi what's up um can we make an insta story together she looks at me and then just continued with her phone I thought that I'm like, ah, Sissy, hi. Can we make an insert story together? And this is legitly how I sounded, very calm. Can we make an story together? Did you get? She just was scrolling through her phone. I think on Snapchat, I was looking for filters or something like that. And I know, I mean, on my phone, did you get? Because if she uses her phone to make the story, I'm not sure she's going to post it. You can never tell. And then how did I get the video? I just wanted to be sure that it was on my phone because I mean, I'm a blogger, I'm a YouTuber. I want to show the world that I'm Sissy. It's not bad here. Yeah? And then. When I when I asked her again, she looked at me and then she was there was just so much reluctance. Like she she just did not know how I felt. She did not know how to just say no yeah. And then she was like, okay. So I think on my phone now I'm trying to make the video. Like I just tapped it. She's like, no, 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 I'm not interested. I said, You're not interested in what? She was like, no, no, no. I want to make a video. I'm like, okay. But you want to take a picture here yeah? and in all sincerity. At the moment when she did that, uh, uh, I just felt silly. I just felt like, you know what? She's a human being like you. It's not a must. You must have a picture with CC or a video with CC. Just move on. But I mean, the blogger in me said, no, Umi, take the picture and just come and tell people what you experience. I'm like, okay, let's take a picture together, yeah? And then I took a picture with her. But like, when I got home, I was really angry. I'm never going to lie. Well, not angry. I was just disappointed. I just felt like the CC that I had thought, or the CC I thought I knew watching her live on insta on um, bb ninja even on instagram you know i just thought she would have been more friendly and accessible than what i experienced so i just brought my phone and i started to write i put everybody's pictures and when i put your picture i'll just see my, my experience with you so i said chloe shaku shaku queen i said Rico. i wrote my experience what i just told you now i wrote it on instagram and then when i got to this point i just said you know i left the worst for the last CC and I now said to explain this and I explained to you yeah and I now finished with saying you know um, if you're a fan because I because I mean really and truly I pushed on because I was a blogger because I really wanted the picture if I was just a fan I feel like if she if after that point when she did na 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 I would have just gone I felt silly and you know I just felt like lower than myself yeah and so I ended by saying now let's imagine I wasn't a blogger and just a fan. Uh, is this really how Sissy would treat her fans? My opinion though, if you meet her in person sometime, make sure you have the mind and patience or just forget talking to her or taking pictures with her if you cannot deal with her BS. And then I'm telling you, Sissy's fans went to, went for me. A useless blogger, I'm fake, I'm not her fan. She could just tell who am I, I'm irrelevant and then, but reading the comments really i wasn't particular about the hate comments because i mean i know sister's fans i've spoken about how my my youtube they can attack is normal but i think one thing i got was the fact that it's really not it's really not by force for her to take or make a video with me you get me it's not by force to make a video with me you know it was her right to say in fact if she had even said oh no i don't want pictures it's her right you know but 
Now let's twist it a little. I was at the mall one day with my friend and I saw Tiwa Savage. My friend is a big Tiwa fan, yeah. And then she was shy to talk to Tiwa. And I was like, you know what? I'll go with you. Let's talk to her. And Tiwa was like, I mean, I'm so sorry. And this is how she was. I mean, I'm so sorry. I don't have makeup on. Please, I'm sorry. You know what you do here? Send me a DM on Instagram. I'll follow you back. She was literally apologizing. Literally, because she didn't have makeup. She gave me like, you cannot fault her. I just felt like, and then maybe i was expecting something nicer but thinking about it again she's a celebrity but she's a human being maybe she was in a bad mood maybe not is her right to say i don't want to take pictures with you i want to make video with you maybe i took it too personal do you get me so i went back and i edited it and i just you know adjusted what i said so instead of me to have said um I left the words for the last. I just said my first time meeting CC, and I took out that whole boo and um, BS part. And I'm like, you know what? It's really her right to say no and to say yes. Maybe I took it personal or personally rather. You can go, you can go on Instagram here yeah, and check. But I'm talking to you guys right now. This is 22 hours um, after I posted that picture, guys. I have 706 likes on the picture, and I have 156 comment on the page half of which i hate comments and talk to your homie on instagram please check it out just read through what i said and check the comments and just tell me if just tell me if they correlate really because i'm a blogger it's my job to just share my experience and i did and then i feel that people just took it out of proportion i mean nobody big past anybody for this world do like if you think you're bigger than me today yeah somebody's bigger than you today also someone's bigger than that person you know like there's, there's no biggest you get me like no matter how rich classy popular hot you are there's somebody who's higher than you so i just feel like if you just give what you want to receive you get me but i mean I'm sorry if you heard TV it's a fan. I'm sorry if you know what I'm saying is annoying to you. I'm just giving you my opinion and my experience. This is just me. This is just what I went through that I'm telling you. I think you should have done better, but I mean, she's CC. She's a human being. She has a right to do anything she wants to do. And yeah, I thought to share with you. I want to just know your own genuine opinion about this story and just be be truthful. If like, and this is not like just try not to hate. Or even if you want to hate, just be truthful yeah what do you think i take it back i take the bs back i take the worst thing back she's a human being and yeah maybe i just expected too much from her or maybe i just deceived myself that i knew her when i clearly don't know her or maybe she was in a bad mood or maybe anything you know but well, yeah that's what i feel please go to the comment section and tell me your opinion about this my story and if you like this please don't do all give me a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel because i want subscribers thank you so much for watching Bye bye. I want to do another video about Miracle and Nina. So anticipate that. <laughs> yes, thank you very much. Bye bye.